And so it's installment two of my garage workshop renovation. Yeah, that's what we'll call it. So anyway, I've got a couple pieces of plywood. They need to go on the wall up here. My friend Mike's going to help me. And then um, I might get to actually move some of this. But I, the next step is i got to get over here and move this stuff away from the wall in order to run some more electrical, install some more insulation, and then more plywood. And then my bridge port, which badly needs to be put back together, can come over in the corner. This can go over here, and I can move forward. So I'm going to go into stop motion or, or time-lapse video because uh, I don't think this is terribly exciting. So anyway, here we go. Okay, so at this point, I've got the four pieces of plywood in. Now what I'm going to do is, on the upper pieces, because I know I probably want to hang stuff on these, I'm going to go ahead and uh, put some longer screws in that I, ha I know have more bite in a couple places on these upper panels, mainly middle and above. So that's the next step back to time lapse. All right, so I've reinforced the plywood with a lot of big screws. And the reason is, is I plan to hang a lot of tools and stuff up on the wall and it'll probably be heavy, so I don't want any of it coming down. And, and again, that's the whole reason behind the 5 8 plywood for the walls, is I want to make sure I can hang anything anywhere. So next, I need to get this stuff away from the wall um, so that I can work on this wall. So I'm going to start working on that.
All right, so I think that is today's installment. Uh, I got a, lot, a little further than I thought. So the next thing, I got to go pick up some fiberglass insulation for this wall, and I got to take this down. Um, I'll do that tomorrow, and I don't know where I'm going to put this stuff. I'll figure that out. But once I get the insulation up, I can put up another probably four pieces of plywood. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So we'll take the plywood down to here, and then I got to think about how I want to do that section there. Um, probably need to dismount the uh, heater and rework that whole corner. But at any rate, once I get the majority of this done, then I can figure out how this is going to come back up on here, and I can move forward with the project and start to get my garage in order. Maybe this week. I gotta see what my money looks like, because that's part of the reason this has taken me so long. It's just 2020 was a shitty year, as I'm sure all of you know. So anyway, thanks for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of my videos. I can't promise what I'll work on next, but I can promise I'll keep doing videos and showing my projects, and hopefully it inspires you to do cool things in your life and to do whatever it is that interests you. Thanks.